give the floor to the distinguished representative of international organization for the elimination of all forms of racial discrimination. Firstly, we would like to thank the special representative for her work in preparing this report. Our organizations have been deeply shocked and saddened to hear about the ongoing sale of children in many parts of the world, particularly in areas of conflict such as Syria and Iraq, just to name a few. The usage of children, the most innocent and fragile individuals of human society, as objects to be abused and harmed is shocking. This particular tragedy has only been made possible at, the scale, at this scale as a result of ongoing lawlessness and conflict, leaving a vacuum in security for criminal elements to take advantage of the children. The recent events showed the sale of children in the Levant to become brides and slaves is truly shocking to anybody with a conscience. While most of us would view the constant and ongoing improvement in technology as a positive advancement in improving our lives, it is sadly also being exploited by criminals to facilitate their trade in children. Through the online advertising of child prostitutes to the sharing and distribution of child pornography, the Internet has sadly made it easier to attain these illegal services and thus has also had the adverse effect of increasing the demand. We thus agree with the report for both an increase in the efforts of cybersecurity and the security organs of various states to act upon any leads to crimes of this nature, this being the best short-term solution in combating this problem. We wish to stress that we fully support the report's call for self-identified pedophiles to come forth and seek help with professionals. As mentioned in the report, this should go hand in hand with media campaigns that both discourages people from engaging in pedophilia as well as raise awareness to the fact that this is a serious issue. The International Organization for the Elimination of All Forms of Racial Discrimination, the Geneva Center for Justice, would like to highlight the fact that poverty is the source of many evils. Poverty often increases corruption amongst individuals tasked with upholding and enforcing the law, which in turn allows for criminals to act with impunity in luring children to their criminal schemes of child prostitution and pornography. We recommend the international community come together for the joint campaign.